I'm done, finally. Let me show you what I did. I enlarged the returns as usual. It's two returns here, so that's one over there. And this is the other one. Let me show you what else I did to the unit. Uh, there used to be a gas furnace here, but now we put an air handler with a heat pump. And as you can see, I used angle metal to stabilize the unit so this thing does not move. But it's being held up by your unistrut and out thread. As you can see right there. Our filter dryer is in the vertical position. By flow, yes. There's more of those angle metals that I put here so that the unit does not rock back and forth during our earthquakes that we get from time to time here in Cali. Here is our drain pan. I didn't have room for a regular P-trap, so I had to make my own. I thought it worked out pretty good. Um, secondary is going into the pan, and the pan is going into the safety overflow switch, which will kill the R, the event of a water leak. But there it is, using existing supply ducts. Now I'm gonna go and show you. And here is the condenser. All right. I don't know why it's always dark when I leave.